GarageBand is a fully equipped music creation studio inside your Mac with a complete sound library that includes instruments and sounds, a perfect addition to your Vocaster setup. In this video, I'll be showing you how to set your Vocaster as your audio device and find your Vocaster's inputs. Let's open GarageBand. Before you start creating and editing, you want to make sure that your Vocaster is set as GarageBand's default input and output device. Simply select GarageBand, Preferences, and a small Preferences window will appear. Under the Audio MIDI tab, locate Devices. Beside Output Device, select Vocaster 1 USB. And then beside Input Device, select Vocaster 1 USB. Let's identify your Vocaster's inputs. To the left of your screen, you'll see your tracks. And by selecting a track and then selecting the Audio Smart Controls button near the top left, a window will appear at the bottom, where you'll see the recording settings for the track you've just selected. To set the input to mono or stereo, you can toggle between one circle for mono and two overlapping circles for stereo. We'll be going through each input of your Vocaster in accordance to the two options you see on screen, mono and stereo. Mono inputs. Having selected mono, the inputs you want to be using are as follows. Input 5, your Vocaster's host microphone, shown here on the back panel of your Vocaster and shown here within Vocaster Hub. Input 6 is your Vocaster's auxiliary external input, shown here on the back panel of your Vocaster and shown here within Vocaster Hub. Having selected stereo, the inputs you want to be using are as follows. Inputs 1 and 2, video call left and right, is your show mix from Vocaster Hub and what you hear in your headphones and speaker outputs. But this is with loopback ones left and right channels removed, meaning when used with Squadcast, Zoom and other similar applications, your remote guests will not hear themselves, removing any chance of feedback or echoes occurring. Inputs 3 and 4, show mix left and right is your show mix from Vocaster Hub and what you hear in your headphones and speaker outputs. This show mix left and right channel can be recorded into a door, allowing you to record your show mix as a stereo recording, not having to mix your show later. Inputs 7 and 8 and 9 and 10 are your Vocaster's loopback 1 and loopback 2 channels, shown here within Vocaster Hub. These two inputs control the level of up to two audio sources generated within your computer. For example, audio from the internet, like YouTube, or pre-recorded audio files from media sources within your computer, such as Apple Music. 